Hello, welcome. Uh, this video is about the derivation of the absolute error formula in division. So we are given that if the numbers x and y are each approximated to small x and small y with the errors delta x and delta y respectively. So our aim now is to find a number z such that it is equal to x divided by y. So, but uh, we shall have an approximated z which is equal to small x over small y. Then our capital X is equal to small x plus change in x. Our capital Y is equal to small y plus change in y. And as well, the capital Z is a small z plus error in z. So what we are going to do here, we are going to say z, which is z plus delta z is equal to x, which is x plus change in x over y plus change in y. So when we get here, we can try to uh, rationalize the denominator here. We can have z plus change in z equal to x plus delta x divided by y plus delta y. So we can multiply here by y minus delta y, then up by y minus delta y. So here that we do the, uh, the multiplication on the right hand. So here we shall have x times y, which is xy plus y delta x. Then uh, x times b negative x delta y and then we shall as well have delta x delta y. So this is divided by, so when you look at this square square, it is a difference of two squares. So we shall have y squared minus delta y squared. So we can first say since delta x and delta y are very small, delta x, delta y, to zero and delta y squared will also tend to zero. So meaning our z plus delta z will be equal to xy plus y delta x minus x delta y then we divide this by y squared. So we can simplify, we can divide by each. So I shall get xy over y squared plus y delta x over y squared minus x delta y over y squared. So I shall have one of the y's going even here. So now z plus L in Z is equal to X over Y plus change in X over Y then minus X delta Y over Y squared. So, but remember our Z is equal to X over Y. So we shall have delta Z being equal to delta y over no, delta x over y minus x delta y over y squared. So we can go to our next page. 
So we had that delta Z is equal to delta X over Y minus X delta Y over Y squared. We can introduce the magnitude here. Say delta Z, same as magnitude of delta X over Y plus magnitude of X delta Y over Y squared. So this is the formula for absolute error division. So we can as well look at uh, the formula for relative error and x divided by y, which will be delta z over z. So this is going to be delta x over y plus x delta y over y squared. Then this divided by x over y. So which will later multiply by the reciprocal. So we shall say this would be delta x over y plus x delta y over y squared. Then all of this expression is multiplied by y over x. Relative error will be equal to, so when we multiply by this, this y here we move away with the y, so we shall remain with delta x over x then plus uh, one y here will go with one, and then the x will go with the x, so we shall remain with the delta y over y. So still. This is the formula for relative error. X divided by Y or in division.